All right, this is Red. I'm out here with Wiley today. And uh, we're gonna show you how to set up the stand, the gold cube stand. You see how the bolts, the tighten down wing nuts on there? See how those are underneath, but there's two in the back here that are on top. And that's so you can make an adjustment while you get the cube and then when you put the topper unit on, you'll see what I mean here in a little bit. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to put the pieces that you're going to get with the uh, with our topper unit. We're going to put those on now. And you can see there's two extensions that come with it. Those extensions don't clamp down at all with any wing nuts. Now that we've got all the bubbles out of that, we'll go ahead and place it onto the stand. You want to make sure the lip on the front of it is overhanging the very front. Okay, and we're just going to keep going with these. Get all the bubbles out of it and then stack it up. Alright, so here we're going to mount our topper unit onto the stand. And as you can see, Right up here at the very top of the topper unit is a, uh, a latching piece of uh, aluminum. And what that's going to do is that's going to fit over the very top piece of the stand. And just like that. Now something that's very important is when we line up the bottom of this thing is that we want to make sure that that indentation, that lip right there, that lip right there is directly over the top of our buffer plate. There. So that is going to rest right against that buffer plate. Now we're going to take the screen and we're going to place it on there. And you notice that on the very end of the screen, here let me pan out a little bit, on the very end of the screen we've got two aluminum angles. One of them goes in to our area where the water trough is going to drop into the cube. That's that one. Now you watch how this works because when that the one for the water trough, you push it all the way back, the one for the water trough will slide in there into the trough, and then the angle on the front is going to slide over the end of the cube. Right there. Now that we've got that in place, we can adjust our angle on the back end. All right, well, here's our spray bar running. It's adjustable, so you can uh, just simply turn the piece of pipe there, the spray bar pipe, and you can adjust the height. On the gold cube, you want to have an even flow coming out the bottom. So we're ready to start shoveling. 